Hey YouTube, uh, this is Alexander Hart again. Uh, today I have uh, an issue with this uh, auto darkening welding helmet. Uh, if you are a professional of welding, you probably know this kind of um, yeah, this kind of device. It protects your eyes when you're welding, and it's uh, auto automatic darkening. So you don't need to um, to pull up your head or. Uh, for to check what you are doing, you just put your helmet in front of your eyes and uh, just uh, wondering. Uh, so the, um, there is a lot of uh, brand of uh, d uh, darkening welding helmet, and uh, this kind of uh, protection have not the an external battery. It have. Uh, a solar front panel in uh, in front and uh, some uh, infrared uh, sensor here uh, which are, are able to detect infrared uh, coming from your welder if you make a um, welder with fire uh, with gas uh, with acetylene etc you can use this one for to detect infrared so you can you can use this uh, element for different kind of uh, weldering and this uh, solar is mainly used for to detect um, arc uh, spark uh, so this one this one doesn't work uh, as you can see it's always flashing always flash, flashing and it, it doesn't permit to you to work properly so the problem is uh, in fact um, uh, even if it have not a battery a visible battery outside uh, I have opened it like this and uh, remove the first cover and uh, you see the main glasses and a little PCB well, which have a main circuit control for to to switch on uh, proportionally the, the, the darking effect of the glasses and you have here the, a little battery this little battery is a lithium ion battery and uh, uh, it's it have a very low duty cycle for a device like that if you intend to use it um, during many years it's not it's not possible because the the life of the device is simply the life of your battery and this is a very uh, cheap and uh, low quality battery it's, it's, this is a lithium ion battery uh, maybe it's intended for to um, to have to have something like two years of uh, year of, of, uh, of working after two years your helmet doesn't work so uh, this battery is a three uh, lithium battery of three volts, and uh, unfortunately, I don't have exactly the same battery. And uh, even if I have the same battery, I don't want to replace the same thing because I I think to have the same problem uh, in in many uh, some many months um, in the in the future. So what I want now is to. Um, to try to repair this thing because uh, um, uh, despite the fact that this helmet this kind of helmet have uh, seen their price uh, decreasing a lot uh, during this, uh, this uh, last year it's uh, it's always expensive and I prefer to repair than to uh, ask to my um, to my company to, to, bu to buy another one so uh, what I'm doing it's simply to add um, a triple A battery with a holder like this and it's very easy to do you have here the the negative here and the positive of the last uh, lithium battery and it's very easy to to uh, to, 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 to replace and uh, to change the battery without any switch you don't need to switch because the consumption of this device is very very low so you just have to stack this uh, uh, battery holder like this and put your uh, protective glass on your helmet with the screw etc and you can uh, work so of course i have prepared this video and i'm sure about what, what i'm saying now uh, because I have made this t this uh, kind of tests yet and uh, of course it's work very nice this is the reason why I'm sure to make this video this is uh, not a hazardous video so I'm I'm just uh, I'm going to, to solder the wire 
and uh, to to stuck it like this and uh, and uh, make you a show and if you see now without the battery it's uh, flashing oh. see flashing and you will see with the battery it stop flashing because uh, it intend it will not work very nice And now you can see uh, it doesn't flash anymore. Okay, hope this kind of uh, fix can help you. See you soon.